Hello, Sagittarius. This is you versus them for the 31st through November the 8th. This reading is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, please check out the website at pinkarygem.com and we'll get a crack from there. All right, guys, let's see. How did Sagittarius feel about the relationship with this person? How does Sagittarius feel about the relationship with this person? Knight of Pentacles. It wasn't moving fast enough for you. I feel like somebody was always like bringing up stuff from their past. Um, and that was kind of spilling over into your relationship. But I'm getting that you guys just weren't feeling that shit. Um, Taurus energy is here. <clears throat> What's this other person's feelings about the relationship with, Ta with Sagittarius? Did I say Taurus? I hope I didn't. Sagittarius is reading, okay? Get out, Taurus. How did this other person feel about the relationship? King of Pentacles. This person felt like it was pretty solid. They felt it was pretty solid. But I feel like, you know, it was on their speed. It just wasn't on yours. I feel like you guys would have liked a lot more action, a lot more playfulness. And I feel like maybe this person was way too serious. They had to plan things out. It wasn't um, uh, a situation where you could just be spontaneous. And I, I'm, I'm getting a little boring for you. But for this person, you know, it, it was all good. It was all good. They were all settled in and nestled in with you guys here, okay? Again, this Earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. What's currently going on with my Sagittarius friends? What's currently going on? Okay. Three of Pentacles. Hmm. There's a situation where you're, I feel like some of you guys are actually trying to work something out with someone here. Trying to compromise. I'm hearing that, you know, this person, you feel like it's good for you. You feel they're good for you. That just because they're not like you doesn't mean that they they are not for you. Um, and that's true. You know, sometimes, you know, people compliment us. Because I, for one, am somebody that I get something in my head and then I'm on. I'm on it. I want to do it. And I want it like yesterday. So to have somebody that kind of like balances me out probably would be um, beneficial for my ass. <laughs> okay. Let's see. What's currently happening for the other person? What's currently happening for the other person? Page of Swords. Hmm. I feel like this person's not really taking you at your word. Um, so I feel like they are watching you. They're watching your actions. They're watching what you're saying. They, you know, what you're doing. Um, they're not saying a whole lot. I feel like they're taking all this shit in though. This person may be watching your social media. Um, if you work with this person, they are probably like just kind of checking you out and you might not even know it or you might catch them looking at you, you know, but they're definitely paying attention. I feel this is um, Gemini Libra Aquarius energy here with this page of swords. What's influencing this situation with Sagittarius? What's influencing the situation? Strength. I feel like you guys are definitely uh, evaluating yourselves and and how you normally behave. And I feel like you're fighting certain urges to just get up and move and, and just change, you know, change relationships or or just kind of like um, change situations so easily without actually giving it some effort. So I feel like you are actually restraining yourselves from whatever normal behavior that you guys exhibit. Um, I definitely see you guys kind of like doing a self check here with this Leo energy, for sure. What's currently influencing the other person? What's currently influencing the other person? They don't want to come out. Oh, see the Ace of Pentacles there. This person wants to be sure that you know what you want. 
um, and that you're not just going to get up and leave when things get tough. Uh, they would like to see something that is like not written in stone, but so damn close to it, to where they don't have to question your intentions or anyone else's for that matter. I'm definitely getting that this person is trying to figure out if this is a situation that's going to be beneficial for them in the long run. Okay. Again, that earth energy there with the pentacles. Strong earth energy in your reading. What's coming in for Sagittarius? What's coming in for Sagittarius? What's coming in for Sagittarius? The four, is it the four of wands? No, it's the five of wands for your conflict. Again, Leo energy. Huh. I feel like you guys are resisting the urge to be combative, to be um to have conflict with this person to question things you're resisting the urge to excuse me guys i saw my hands very ashy but you're resisting the urge to be argumentative um and, and to just do things haphazardly without first thinking about it i feel i feel like, like this person is really trying to decide whether or not you know they should like invest with you guys here further i also feel like there's some sort of proposal on the table that this person is really thinking about whether it's a marriage proposal or you know moving in um something that is very uh legitimate though very legitimate very stable very secure they're really like contemplating this shit okay What's coming in for Sagittarius? And I think you're really going to be conflicted about whatever it is that this person's bringing towards you. I really feel like, yeah, it's going to throw you off a little bit. What's coming in for the other person? Oh, look at that shit. Five of Wands. <laughs> Why are you guys getting into it? Why are you getting into it? Because they have the five of wands, what's coming in for them, and you have a five of wands. Can't make this shit up. I almost feel like this person's testing you. I feel like they're going to test you. Because they want to see how you react, how you respond in a situation. This person wants to feel like you guys are going to be in this for the long haul. Can you carry this with them? Can you share the responsibility of this relationship and all that it entails? This Ten of Wands is divided up. So this is like sharing the responsibility, sharing the load here. Being able to work things out amicably. But I'm getting that there's going to be some tense um, moments and situations with this person. What is the outcome here for Sagittarius? What is the outcome for Sagittarius? Queen of Swords. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy. This could definitely be a person that is um, has been hurt um, and, and basically is turning their back on foolishness. Uh, the Queen of Swords is a truth seeker, but this is a person that's been hurt and um, they are easily pushed honestly you can push this person's buttons and they probably would go the fuck off is the thing so I feel like that's probably this person this is probably like a Capricorn um, energy here Capricorn Aquarius I feel energy where you know they're kind of no nonsense is the thing and I think that is kind of what makes you 
leery of this person at times because you know being a fire energy you don't want to feel like held back and and having a finger pointed at you all the time for not wanting to be still or being too spontaneous um you don't want to be bored I, i'm just getting straight to the point you just don't want to be bored okay and you don't want to be mothered or fathered <clears throat> what is the outcome here Huh. Five of Cups and the Moon. Somebody being in their feelings. This person likes to know exactly what the hell is up. They don't like surprises here. And I feel like this person, um, the unknown makes them feel some kind of way. It's like they, this person likes to plan out everything and anything out of the ordinary just makes them uncomfortable. I see this person getting down on themselves. I see them being in a dark place, getting in a dark place. Okay, so the camera froze, which it seems like it has a habit of doing these days. But um, I definitely see this person getting in this dark place because they, they like you know what do you call it um they like order and i feel like us being like fire energies um order is not so much of a, a major concern of ours and um that for somebody else that really does like you know strict order that can seem like a flakiness to them and so um i, I definitely see that you guys are po possibly getting into a disagreement or argument with them um again we have three fives here they have two you have one that is five 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 um a, a tower moment so something sudden happening because there's something that's not working here okay there's i feel like there's not enough give is what the deal is here okay guys so we have cancer scorpio i feel like libra um libra uh aquarius capricorn taurus energy leo's here as well all right guys so that's what i have for you and i'll be speaking with you guys soon bye